Imagine replacing deceased or injured tissues with healthy ones. Engineered in a lab, imagine restoring tissue function with regenerative devices, tailored specifically for you through 3D printing, or a liquid to solid phase change that jumpstarts healing. Imagine tissues and organs that are engineered to tell you and your doctor when they are functioning and when they are not. At Northwestern University, research at the intersection of biology, physical sciences, engineering, and medicine is driving new capabilities that are turning these concepts into reality. The technological advances and the job skills that will make these breakthroughs possible are captured in a new field called regenerative engineering. Dr. Guillermo Amir is leading a team of investigators that is at the forefront of this revolutionary research. Our research group's contribution to regenerative engineering stems from our effort to develop novel advanced liquid and solid biomaterials that are based in citric acid, a compound that we encounter every single day of our lives and that our body actually also produces. These biomaterials range in size from the nanoscale, which is one billionth of a meter, to the macro dimensions, which is what you can see and touch. And they can be engineered to become scalable and reproducible tools that are specifically designed to promote tissue and organ regeneration. Our materials have been applied to address diabetes, bladder disease, cardiovascular disease, bone, cartilage, as well as ligament repair and regeneration. Born and raised in Panama City, Panama, Professor Amir moved to the United States where he began his higher education at Collin County Community College in Texas. He then received his Bachelor's of Science degree in Chemical Engineering with highest honors from the University of Texas at Austin. His passion for learning and applying his engineering skills to medical problems drove him to pursue his doctoral degree in Chemical and Biomedical Engineering at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. My experience in Northwestern has been absolutely amazing. I've learned new techniques and learned how to solve problems using biomaterials. And for my project, Type 1 Diabetes, I look forward to going to graduate school and starting my PhD in biomedical engineering. Dr. Amir's work has been featured on the cover of several scientific magazines. He has co-authored over 250 publications and has over 40 patents issued and pending in nine countries. Dr. Amir has received numerous awards and has been elected a fellow of three national professional societies. His technologies have given a rise to several companies that are developing innovative medical products. Growing up in Panama, I could not have foreseen the path that led me to where I am today. I was encouraged by my parents, may they rest in peace, and teachers to do my best. I've always been interested in solving problems that affect all of us. Today. I lead a very talented, diverse team of researchers and trainees at all levels at Northwestern University, one of the top institutions in the world. I'm very excited about the possibilities of translating the work that we do in the lab to hospitals and when they have an impact on patient care worldwide.